I think. Uh, I would have been nine years old. Okay, we're back up here. I'm we're we're up here now. We're to the Bigfoot trap. Jr. is uh, standing there looking at it. Um, Isabel. Moses, H, and Isabel. Huh? Well, anyway, we're we're up here. It's raining still. We got our walking sticks. We've had a good hike up here so far. So when we go back down, we're gonna continue up the trail that's down here along the creek, and we're gonna go up to the mine. Not sure how far it is, but uh, we are gonna we're gonna give that a shot. Jr. has evidently climbed into the Bigfoot trap, so I think I will just leave him here and go home. And uh, no, I won't do that. I'm tempted though. Ugh. No, it won't. It's it's welded in place. Look, we caught a Bigfoot. <laughs> a wet Bigfoot. A wet yeah, we're soaking wet out here, but we're having a great time. We're having a good time. <clears throat> we left the church at what? 8.30 and now it's like 10.30. We've been out here quite a while. We've been having a fun time. This was well worth it. Amen. Yeah. Where'd they weld it at? It's fixed up there somehow. I don't know. It's bolted. I think it's those lower bolts. Right here? Yeah. The cables. Oh, right here. There's cables inside dangling that'll... That'll uh, drop the uh, trap down. Drop the drop the drop the drop the door down on him. I'm gonna climb up here and get a. Uh, should we sing our song again? When we were just doing down there. Here, I'll start. Thank you, O oh our Father, for giving us your Son and leaving your Spirit here until the work is done. Thank you, Jesus. That was steep. Oh. For, giving yeah. for giving us your son. Is it giving us your son or leaving? It's uh, thank you, O oh, our Father, for giving us your son and leaving your spirit here until the work is done. Oh, it is beautiful up here. <clears throat> or my personal favorite, Jr. For the Lord is good, His mercy everlasting. And his truth endures. Oh, I can't sing that without being out of breath. There goes J.R. up the hill. Oh, my goodness. This is so beautiful up here. It's quiet. It's peaceful. No Bigfoot. Just beautiful up here. We're the only ones up here. I don't even know if there's anybody down at the lake in weather like this, because it's raining everywhere in Medford and so forth. Uh, there may be nobody even at the lake. We've got this whole big, beautiful area all to, all to ourselves. Hmm. Well, I left my gloves down there, my walking sticks. How far up are you going to go? Okay, yeah, because i got to go down and get my stuff. 
And then we probably should start heading down. Now you can see the tree that fell way over there. There's a the stump. And you can see how close it came to the trap. And it goes way up here. Oh my goodness, that's a big tree. That came so close to landing on the trap. It would be nothing but sawdust right now if it had. None of this area up here has been logged. It is all, uh, a lot of it's old growth timber. There's no sign of a bulldozer having been here. Anything, nothing. Just beautiful. Untouched, basically. <sighs> Go on just a tad bit farther. There seems to be another ravine here. Again, I hope this isn't poison oak. that <laughs> okay I think it's time to leave now very very untouched forest here it took us 20 minutes to drive up here from the church another 20 minutes from Medford and then about a half an hour to walk up here it's all within reach of Medford it's a beautiful, beautiful area. As soon as JR gets down here, I got a question for him. They see something down this down in this ravine that's very unusual. See this down here? That black? Yeah, that's a root wad. Yeah, that's a tree that's turned over and that's all the roots sticking yeah. up. They're sticking way up high, aren't they? Yeah. When we get down there, we'll take a look at it from that angle. Because I see dirt and rocks. And yeah, that's how they grow. See trees in here don't, where roots don't go straight down? They go out like this. And that's how they hold each other up. That is bizarre. Isn't that funny how they, the roots don't go directly down? They kind of spread out this way. Well, we got to get back down now. So I guess we'll start our last video once we get up to the mine shaft. So we'll see you there.